It takes a day and a half to make his supply using a roaster on the peanuts he bought in Ridgeland. How's your more peanuts today? <laughs> and Jesse Houston, who's had cerebral palsy since birth, has the process down. He bags. Honing his skills years back, selling that Jackson Mets games in the 80s. Jesse's been coming here for over 30 years. Everybody loves him. He sells all his peanuts. Most of the time he'll sell them all the first day and can't come back the second day because he ain't got nothing else to sell. From his tiny asking price, a buck a bag or $3 for four, all the way to the vehicle he himself drives, a loud little three-wheeler, nothing about Jesse seems to fall within what's considered normal. And people notice there's not a speck of negativity in the man who, until age 14, had to scoot around on his knees to get around. But he always says, I don't want no help. I can do it. I can do it by myself. But we always try to lend him a hand. And like I said, we appreciate him coming. I love Jesse doesn't have to pay to be a part of these events. That's the agreement he worked out with the trademark. He says on days like these, he just tries to break even, holding no thoughts of retirement in his mind. I can't. Take it easy. You can't take it easy? Uh, I got you go.